Hi Virgo, this is your reading for the 21st uh, till the 27th of February and I'm using uh, a new deck and these two decks are by the same author and I'm using the Tarot uh, Leaves and the Dream Raven Tarot and you can see the reviews in the playlists. So if you would like to have a look at the artwork and the deck then please do you come in with the queen of pentacles so this week uh, could mean that you can find out that you're pregnant or your partner is pregnant sorry about the glistening i have to use the false light because it's really dark um so anyway coming back to the queen of pentacles she mainly represents virgo but don't forget taurus or Capricorn she also has the green fingers so anything that she touches will turn to gold in other words because her husband has the meters touch but she's got the green fingers because she um, is a nerd she's also known as Mother Earth she sows seeds she harvests crops she also represents fertility for getting pregnant the woman the feminine also uh, she loves animals so definitely you have the green fingers so whatever you sow you shall reap also what i'm hearing here i'm trying to i'm trying to get a better light i'm sorry about it it annoys me okay also you could find out you're pregnant or you could be hearing of a birth or of a project if you're too mature to get pregnant so you could be finding out that a friend or your daughter or son is becoming a father or a mother the hierophant uh, is also an earth sign he represents taurus um, so you've got quite a bit of earth uh, to start off with with the all over energy also that means that you could be seeking advice about an investment on where to sow the seeds or what uh, if you're talking about a financial investment and this could also be uh, spiritual guidance as he is also known as the high priest and I just love it and uh, this is lo looks like the staff of the high event so you, you do see the traditional uh, images coming back in uh, in this deck also you can see the crown and that is like the bud the crown of the high event also, this could be uh, somebody that you respect and love and trust that is mature, that you could seek advice from, or a professional. This could be the priest or um, a registrar, a justice of the peace. But you could be getting married, so you could be seeking advice or making appointments on advice on appointments on when to get married, when the registrar is able to marry you, or in the church. This could also be uh, anybody because he represents municipalities, governmental institutions and institutions um, with regards to finances, buying a house, getting loans, things like that. Also, this could be a teacher, a, a guide. Also, you have the Ace of Wands. The Ace of Wands, all aces are a form of victory because it is um, um, an opportunity being presented to you by the Divine or the Cosmos. The Ace of Wands represents Aries, Leo and Sagittarius. You could be meeting or dealing with one of these people. But the Wands stand for actions, um, being strategic, um, also create creativity, passion passion could be the hobby or could be with a person a passionate love affair could be starting or you could be doing uh, getting a passion uh, a vocation or a career that you're passionate about then you'll be a very rich person because then your work will feel like a hobby you also have the queen of wands which is leo so we have leo twice and um we definitely have leo here with strength so leo is quite prominent in your reading we also 
the Queen of Wands, she's also very strategic. She's got her emotions under control as she goes for what she wants. She plans how to do it and she's creative about it because she definitely will get what she wants. Um, sometimes she might even forget her own boundaries or other people's boundaries, but she's very businesslike, she's career orientated, and then she comes into action. So if, it, if you're not dealing with a Leo or with a, uh, a career orientated person with a powerful will, then you could be taking a page out of her book, coming into action for something new. Now, it's lying next to the lovers, so it could be a new lover, like I said. But the lover, uh, lovers also represent Gemini, and the lovers, of course, also mean uh, meeting your soulmate. Or finding out that you are with your soulmate. You doesn't have to be your partner. This could be a partner in business. This could be a best friend for life. You think the same. You can finish each other's sentences. You're from the same caliber. You've got the same interests. So that's where, um, that's why you are best friends for life. Now you've also got the two of pentacles. Sorry about that, Virgo. The telephone went. We were at the lovers, best friends, etc soulmates also you have the two of pentacles and the two of pentacles means that you could be balancing or trying to balance your books or your money um, your heart or your mind or your heart and your soul or the work front and the home front also two means to me partnering up so again definitely confirming partnering up or working with a partner you are in your strength since you've got the strength card the strength card represents leo so you could also have a leo around you or you could be meeting a leo um, your strength this is the physical strength the chariot is the mental strength so you're physically strong so you can get back into balance usually the, um, the strength card is number eight so that's the house of money and the house of strength confirming your in your strength your patience your tenacity your determination is paying off also you've got the page of pentacles this could be news about a child or uh, child uh, subsidies uh, child support if you are in a judicial situation also this could mean that you could be getting news uh, about something tangible durable and for long term this could be a relationship this could be a friendship this could be also um, uh, a job or a promotion something to do with something that's going to be good for your future Virgo you definitely will have good news and why can I say you have good news because you've got the ten of cups that's ultimate happiness that's expansion job um, uh, you might be getting that job if you haven't got a job a promotion a wage rise ultimate happiness happiness a reunion with family and friends celebrations so something good is going to happen the ten of cups also means uh, marriage uh, could be expanding the family or you could be expanding the family home or you could be moving home from an apartment to a house and a garden. Ten is an ending to emotional difficulties and a new happier face and a better face is coming in. Justice, you've got justice, so justice will be done. It's lying next door to the page. So again, I, I didn't even notice that. I said um, child support, child uh, subsidies. So you could be getting a grant for your child uh, for school or for a study something like that the justice card also represents a uh, libra so you could be meeting a libra or dealing a libra again again the libra has is the scales so that means balance bringing in the balance feeling the balance and also justice will be done if somebody's done you wrong or you've done somebody wrong anyway i'll take it that it resonates that somebody might have done you wrong they will get what they deserve and so will you you might be dealing with the hierophant in that case that could be the advocate the lawyer or the legal advisor 
also um, one of the birds is holding a letter so you could be getting a love letter or a, a letter with beautiful energy okay so i hope you've enjoyed this so far now i'm going to pull an oracle card from the surrender deck and that is one of my oldest decks this one is sticking out the furthest and it says surrender to play so let your inner child come out to play definitely with the lovers wow and we've just had valentine take a break from overthinking a goal do something fun play is a time of recreation and rejuvenation so you are actually busy with something could be a hobby or something funny going for a walk something fun i mean that you enjoy either with your partner or alone get some uh, recreation time in and you will feel rejuvenated and you will bring in the balance wow it doesn't have to cost any money my little virgo go 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 you're the best just remember that if you think that then it will turn out to be like that you'll start beaming like a star take care stay safe and please support the channel even if you haven't subscribed yet please subscribe because half of my viewers haven't subscribed it's all for free you won't get funny emails so why not just hit that subscription button and the bell if you don't want to be notified hit on private thank you so much for your support love you loads bye bye